All right, good morning, guys. So it is actually two days after Thanksgiving. Um, as you know, like in my last video, I dyed my hair this dark brown color from like the orange because I was just like so sick of it. And I told you guys I was gonna straighten it and cut it, but I didn't um, cut it yet. I just straightened it and left it like this for a few days. But today I'm gonna be cutting it and washing it and styling it and stuff like that. Um, the video for me dyeing my hair will be uploaded today. Um, and then this video will probably be uploaded tomorrow. But anyways, so um, yeah, let's just jump into it. So, so like for my last video, um, as you know, I had like a special guest, 22Q or whatever. Um, he's gonna be in this video. He's gonna be one cutting my hair. Um, he's cut my hair previously in the past and done such a great job. Um, uh, he was over there in the closet, but I don't know where he went. There he go. So yeah, he's gonna be cutting my hair. And then we're just gonna go from there. I'll take a before and after picture. Um, just so y'all can see how much was cut off. So this is how long it is. Um, basically like to the middle of my back or whatever. And I'm thinking about cutting it to like my shoulders. Cause that's like where it's like breaking off at. Oh, and I have bangs by the way. Well, they've been pulled back so they look horrible. But I did cut some bangs. I'll insert some pictures so y'all can see what that looked like as well. Um, yeah, so. It feels healthier already. It feels so thick. I like it. Thumbnail. Move. I'm leaving this in here. Oh, I'm doing. <laughs> okay. All right. So I just um, got done washing my hair. Well, I didn't wash it because I didn't want some of the um, black to fade out. But I just got done um, deep conditioning my hair. The front still have like some straight pieces that I'm gonna cut off like over time. I don't want to cut it off right now because. I don't want to have like a fro, you know, but I did cut off um, quite a bit in the back. So the back is pretty much like curling up for the most part. And then just like, um, just like over time, I'm just going to keep trimming it and trimming it. But this is as short as I want it to go as far as like, um, like <laughs> this is just how short I want it to go. I don't know why I said as far as I don't know what I was going to say after that. But um, basically, I'm just going to put in a leave-in conditioner um, and I might cut some more pieces off. Um, I might cut like a couple of these off, like the ones in the front. Um, I don't know, but I'm just going to like style it and then I'm going to show you guys what it looks like when I'm done. So yeah. Okay, so I just finished blow drying my hair. The back is dry. The front is still probably like... 60% wet um I just didn't feel like over like blow drying it too much because I'm just trying to keep as much heat away from it as possible um but I definitely need to cut the front parts because like I said they're just too straight and I just needed to curl up like the back the back pretty much um curled up pretty nicely it's pretty frizzy because my um my um leave-in conditioner and like leave-in gel how I applied it was like kind of messy. I just heard it been raking through my hair. So my curls are not gonna be like the most defined, but they are definitely healthier, I can tell. 
um, without like all these damaged pieces hanging from them. So I'm excited about that. Um, I'll probably just wear my hair like in a ponytail because I don't like my hair being this short and I don't want to pull it and blow dry it to like stretch it out or anything else, like anything like that. So um, yeah. Um, so if you've seen the first part of this video, which was the me dyeing my hair black, then I appreciate you guys and thank you for watching. And if you're watching this part of the video, thank you for sticking around and, you know, finishing out this journey with me. Um, guys, if you have like damaged hair and you want to cut it, like just cut it. Like it's going to grow back. Um, it's going to take a couple years, but it's going to be so much healthier and you're going to love it so much more. Um, so if you're, if you have like, um, damaged hair that so if you have damaged hair that's been like bleached or straightened or anything like that, and um, it's kind of like mine, like how mine, like just go ahead and cut it off because you're gonna end up loving it. Like I already love like the thickness in the back. Like it is so thick. My hair was like never this thick when I um, did a wash and go on my damaged hair. So um, the moral of the story is, what's that saying? Is it like you are not your hair? or you are your hair, you are not, you are not your hair. So, um, <laughs> I don't know. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned to my next video to see what I do to my hair if I do anything, which I'm pretty sure I will because I just, I can't leave it alone, you know. At the end of the day, it's just hair and it grows back. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope you had a great Thanksgiving and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.